Welcome to FXDD TV. I'm your host, Lauren, and with me today is Fred Scala, Vice President of Forex Bar. Fred has decades of experience in the Forex industry, and he'll be doing a series of videos on tips to become a successful trader. Thank you, Lauren. We've done uh, a couple of these in the past. Uh, the last one we did was Know Yourself. And today I want to talk a little bit about Trust Yourself. When traders put together a trading plan, normally they spend some time looking at charts, looking at some fundamental analysis, and determining a pattern. Um, I've, if, it, if, if a currency pair gets to this certain level, I want to buy. If a currency pair gets to that level, I want to sell. Uh, and they'll put entry orders in. What I've always told junior traders that worked for me is whenever you put in an order, make sure you know where you want to get out on a profit basis and on a stop loss basis. You should always know where you're right and where you're wrong. It's very important to stick to that. You spent a couple of hours building up a trading plan. Uh, that trading plan may mean I want to buy right now. A trading plan may mean I, want, I don't want to buy for another you know, 30 pips, 50 pips, 100 pips. But once you determine what your uh, plan is, it's very important to stick to it. And when you stick to it, it's really important to uh, not second guess yourself. The idea, I've put two hours in, I've looked at my charts, I know what my fundamental thoughts are, and I'm going to buy right here. I'm going to buy Euro dollar at 112.50, and if it goes to 111.90, I'm wrong, and I stop myself out. And if it goes to 113.20, I'm going to take my profit. It's very important that you stick to that. I've seen so many times where traders will be right and it'll go right up to their stop profit levels and they'll say, well, that happened too quickly. I, you know, it's happened within the last hour. I'm going to give it a lot more time. And then you, you, you see the market start to erode. You, you've made those decisions based on careful analysis. So don't second guess yourself. Often, oftentimes you see it goes to the profit level and then it starts to back off and then the trader will say, well, if it gets back up to my profit level, then I'll sell. And then it slips back down again. And so, well, if it gets back to where it was a half hour ago, I'll sell. And then it slips back down. And what happens is you've turned a profitable position into a losing position. So you, you've made those decisions based on careful analysis. And it's very important to stick to that. Uh, stop loss orders, limit orders, very important. I always instructed any junior trader, whenever you get an entry, uh, whenever you enter a trade, always make sure you have your stop loss, your limit orders, uh, stop profit, and your stop loss orders in at the same time. Um, be consistent, be, be focused on what you, what you have, but most importantly, trust yourself. You're doing analysis, you're working through those points, and it's very important that you trust yourself and those uh, points that you've put together. Thank you. Thank you, Fred. That was very interesting. I'm sure our viewers will benefit from your tips. That concludes our episode for today. Thank you for being with us, and see you soon.